listen. We need to always listen to ourselves because it makes our lives a little easier. And listening means listening to your guides that give you signals and signals through people, through a bird, through a feeling. We really need to start listening a little bit more. I know I listen as best as I can to to get through the day and just you listen to your feelings. They're feelings, but you can listen to them because they help you be aware of how you feel. And that's a way of listening, listening to your feelings and listening to just the infinites as they give you signs and signals through people, words, sometimes postings on Instagram come up and you're like, oh my gosh, that was so for me. I needed that right now. And it's just a nice little sign for you to listen to and to know to keep going and that you're doing all right. And we're all, they're always there supporting us. We're supporting ourselves. Our, our spiritual guides are supporting us and infinite beings or however you want to phrase it. You just know there's something extra and something more than just the reality of now. And there's just infinite more. So listen Listen gently, listen compassionately, and sometimes listening may be a little awkward and you may not understand, but at least you gave it a try to listen. Because I know sometimes it's just like, did I get that right? Or am I kind of off? But no matter what, you gave it a listen and that's all it counts. So keep listening, keep listening to your heart, your feelings, keep listening to signs and signals, especially when they're just, they're so positive and good feeling. Don't be afraid of good feeling feelings and listen to them because they're just supportive and they're just helping, helping us grow and, and be stronger and just gain our strength and empowerment within our own selves so that we can just be better beings every day. So Appreciate listening to yourself. Appreciate listening out there and um, keep going at it.